In this uh, lecture series, we are going to learn about the Microsoft Office tools. In this lecture, I will give you a brief idea about that. what are the topics that we are going to cover. So first, uh, when we say it's MS Office, what is the meaning of MS? MS stands for the Microsoft, which is the name of the company, which is in the USA. And uh, as we all know that Bill Gates is a owner of the company now what is microsoft office actually this microsoft office is normally used for the some special purpose of the office work like here you can make a documentation worksheets presentation and different database also you can manage uh, ms office provides many packages but these are the office packages we call ms word excel powerpoint and access and this tools we are going to explore the very first package is a microsoft word so microsoft word uh, this is it's a look and feel that how does it look like look so this is the uh, screen this is the interface this is the gui of the microsoft word where you can find different uh, tools different uh, formatting toolbar is there, standard toolbar is there, scroll bar toolbar, scroll bar is there, many toolbar is there that uh, we learn eventually. What is MS Word? The very first question. So this is actually a word processing software um, where you can type different letters, reports, and also you can prepare the documents, right? Any kind of documents you can prepare. So using the keyboard you can enter the data you can add, uh, edit them you can add the images and at the end you can take the print out of the document so it is a purely for the documentation purpose this is the the header bash portion we call it a ribbon where you can find the different shortcuts along with the symbols or icons for them we all uh, will learn gradually Whenever we take one project, we'll learn, we'll use all these tools, all these features. So these are the some main features of the MS Word. It provides that uh, you can create document, add it, you can add graphics, word art is there, you can print the document, mail merge is a very strong feature of MS Word. MS Word also checks the spelling, grammar, the shorts it provides, like it gives a suggestion. Also, auto correction feature is there. So, apart from this, so many other features are features are there. The second package is the Microsoft Excel that you'll see in the next unit. But let's have a, an idea. Excel looks like this, uh, like it's a table kind of format where you can find the rows and columns and cells right so these are the different tools and this is actually the interface of the ms excel where um, office button status bar formula bar everything we will see in the consecutive in the next coming lectures also it has the disp uh, ribbon which displays the various commands and features just like the word so these are the some um, features what you can do with the ms excel you can do lots of operations so many different calculations mathematical operations you can perform with the ms excel and you can create sheet multiple sheets you can create you can create your invoices and so many other things you can do with the ms excel it's a purely based on the mathematical and uh, financial calculations so these are the features of MS Excel. Lots of features are there. We'll see one by one. Uh, it is used for the arithmetic calculations. Also based on the data, you can create a graph and a chart as well. So these are the some uh, example of the Excel functions. There are n number of functions are there, but there are the, these are just uh, an idea like average, count, pi, sum, product, max, if. Apart from this, so many other functions are there which you can use. Just enter the data, use the function, and you'll get the result. It's so easy. Uh, the third package is the PowerPoint. 
this is its look and feel it's very interesting very interactive actually uh, here you have slides you can prepare slides you can give animation you can move the object you can move the text you can animate text it's very interesting it is basically for the animation purpose while you can uh, where you where you can display demo your product your presentation for your product for your company and so many other things also you can record the slides along with the narrations and transitions different different transitions you can use so powerpoint is very very uh, you know very uh, very interesting actually for those who are very those who are very creative so it gives so many different features you can use like animation transitions so many effects are there so these are the features like animation you can do sh auto shapes editing spell check hide and hide so so many different uh, features are there the fourth package is uh, microsoft access which is it is actually um, based on the database for the database it, it is used or uh, where you can uh, store the data and you can retrieve the data with uh, different parameters like suppose you have a huge data and you want to find some particular data from them then you have different uh, different style different uh, queries you can fire you can create the different tables and so many other things you can with the huge amount of data so it's basically related with the database so other uh, things we will uh, learn with the da ms access database how to create database what are records fields table how to create form how to generate report what is primary key all this thing we will see in the ms access so if i say long story short then ms word is basically used for the documents excel is used for the spreadsheets and uh, it, it creates spreadsheets which is actually for the calculations powerpoint is for presentation and in ms access you can manage your database so it's all about your uh, this particular subject where we will see all these tools in detail in next coming lectures till then thank you bye bye take care